Yirmiyahu, Jeremiah 30. The word that came to El Yirmiyahu from Yahuwah, saying, Thus speaks Yahuwah Elohai of Yashadael, saying, Write you eth all the words that I have spoken unto you in a sefer. For lo, the days come, says Yahuwah, that I will bring again at the captivity of my people, Yashadael and Yahuda, says Yahuwah. And I will cause them to return to the land that I gave to their fathers, and they shall possess it. And these are the words that Yahuwah spoke concerning El Yashadael and concerning El Yahuda. For thus says Yahuwah, We have heard a voice of trembling, of fear, and not of peace. Ask ye now, and see whether a man travails with child. Wherefore do I see every man with his hands on his loins, as a woman in travail, and all faces are turned into paleness. Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it. It is even the time of Yaakov's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. For it shall come to pass in that day, says Yahuwah Sevaoth, that I will break his yoke from off your neck, and will burst your bonds, and strangers shall no more serve themselves of him but they shall serve at Yahuwah Eloheim, and at David their king, whom I will raise up unto them. Therefore fear you not, O my servant Yahuv, says Yahuwah, neither be dismayed, O Yashadael, for lo, I will save you from afar, and at your seed from the land of their captivity, and Yahuv shall return, and shall be in rest, and be quiet, and none shall make him afraid. For I am with you, says Yahuwah, to save you, though I make a full end of all nations whither I have scattered you, yet will I not make a full end of you. But I will correct you in measure, and will not leave you altogether unpunished. For thus says Yahweh, Your bruise is incurable, and your wound is grievous. There is none to plead your cause, that you may be bound up. You have no healing medicines. All your lovers have forgotten you. They seek you not. For I have wounded you with the wound of an enemy, with the chastisement of a cruel one for the multitude of your iniquity, because your sins were increased. Why cry you for your affliction? Your sorrow is incurable, for the multitude of your iniquity, because your sins were increased. I have done these things unto you. Therefore, all they that devour you shall be devoured, and all your adversaries, every one of them, shall go into captivity. And they that spoil you shall be a spoil, and all that prey upon you will I give for a prey. For I will restore health unto you, and I will heal you of your wounds, says Yahweh, because they called you an outcast, saying, This is Sion, whom no man seeks after. Thus says Yahuwah, Behold, I will bring again the captivity of Yaakov's tents, and have mercy on his dwelling places, and the city shall be built upon her own heap, and the palace shall remain after the manner thereof. And out of them shall proceed thanksgiving, and the voice of them that make mercy, and I will multiply them, and they shall not be few. I will also glorify them, and they shall not be small. Their children also shall be as aforetime, and their assembly shall be established before me. And I will punish all that oppress them. And their nobles shall be of themselves, 
and their governor shall proceed from the midst of them. And I will cause him to draw near, and he shall approach unto me. For who is this that engaged hath his heart to approach unto me? Says Yahuwah. And ye shall be my people, and I will be your Elohim. Behold, the whirlwind of Yahuwah goes forth with fury, a continuing whirlwind. It shall fall with pain upon the head of the wicked. The fierce anger of Yahuwah shall not return until he have done it, and until he have performed the intents of his heart. In the latter days ye shall consider it.